Hey all there, how are we doing? Hope oh, you're all well. As you can tell, beautiful day. Uh, just come out of Derby City Centre, um, doing the Derby, or was it the Derwent Heritage Walk? Um, just doing the Derby to Bulk section because there's no way I'm doing Shardlow all the way up to the high peaks uh, in one day. But anyway, yes, yeah, just a quick one this week, so we're straight along through, follow through here, Dale Abbey, and then it's over to um, Little Eton, lovely little village there, and uh, yeah, we'll close up through. I still watched a few videos, so there's a few bits to see and whatever, and then we'll finish just outside of Belper where it comes off from around the back. Yeah, weather's nice, but 11 degrees, so it's probably about 8 by the river. Um, the views will get better, it's not all city centre at the moment. And I will make sure we have a good walk. So yeah, let's get going. Right, so as you can tell, I'm a bit groggy. I've not been very well. I didn't get a video up this Sunday, uh, last Sunday, should I say, because basically we had the fear on and I live in the town centre. Anyway, no sleep, made myself very ill. So, I will uh, get the new walk for Friday, so the, on Sunday's video, I'll get that put up on Wednesday on the website. I'll put the website below. Um, and obviously, I'll put in the links to any information because we're going to Dale Abbey, uh, the mill's there, and then we'll cross over there and I'll give you some information about uh, Little Eating and I think there's a former mill tower there. But we'll have a look and then... Uh, yeah, we'll keep going from there. So, won't be a lot of talking on this one because I've got a sore throat. But we'll see what we can do and I'll get plenty of photos anyway. See you in a bit. Right, now if you've never been to Dale Abbey, it's a lovely little riverside walk down to the old mills. And like I say, it's part of the heritage way, but you don't have to do all that way. And especially at the minute, as you can tell, the colours along the river are absolutely beautiful. And these dates Tuesday, there's quite a few people about. So, not my kind of walk, I'd rather be doing it on my own. But anyway, yes, we'll carry on. Not a bad place to live by the river. Anyway, we will pop in, because it's next to the river anyway, we'll pop in to uh, Darley Village. It's a beautiful little place. Um, but obviously it's all been surrounded by modern houses and it's been part of the city now, but anyway, we'll get there and we'll uh, get a bit of video and photos. So here's Dolly Abbey. So we'll get a little bit of video. I'll put a little bit of info up on the screen and then we can uh, chuck you the link down below. This is more of a temporary bridge at the moment because it was a road bridge. It looks as though it's disappeared now. But then again, there were cars coming over and cutting it, using its cut through. So I think they've obviously stopped that now. Anyway, we're going to get a bit more footage. So, the Derwent Valley Way is meant to be one of the best walking trails in Europe. One of the best well known because of history. And here's the tourist opinion, barbed wire fence next to the river. Which I think is a bit, yeah, a bit daft to be honest with you. I think for its history and everything else, excuse the Barry White voice, uh, and everything else, it would be a bit, well, a bit more on the river. Because Derwent Valley, Derwent River, makes sense. But, never mind, 
probably private landowner or something. Yeah, most likely. But there's my moan of the day. So yeah, so far it's been all right. A bit too busy for me around Ale Abbey. I know it's a nice place, but I don't know if anybody's off school or whatever else, but it was just like being there on a Saturday packed. So now we're right, we'll start getting into little eating and then start opening up a little bit anyway. So yeah, see you shortly. Right, there we are. Finally a bit signposted better now. Take such a popular trail. You'd have thought it'd been a bit better. But off that monstrosity of a building, starting to come out of the city now. And you can just see a bit of green. Anyway, let's keep right, going. If you can hear me, this is a bit more boring bit. So we're going straight through Little Eaton this way. And then we'll go left at a road called The Town and then back onto Duffield Road, which will take us to Milldale and then follow the main road and then come off back into the parks in Belper. We'll finish there, so catch up with you shortly. All right, we're in the village now. So we're carrying straight on that way and then uh, we'll turn off soon. It's not as good, can you? Right, so we're not far coming at the other end and there's some very big houses and very nice prices around here. I've no have looked before at the house prices. Um so yeah, we're just on Vicarage Road Vicarage Lane, I think it is at the minute. So we'll carry on and then we'll come off and then we'll start dropping back down to Duffield Road. And then yeah, it's through to Milford and uh, into Belper. So yeah, let's crack on. Right, so into a bit of shade. Which is nice strange to be honest with you because I'm sweating like a well, I won't say what I normally say. Anyway, <laughs> um we'll go this way and then it'll drop down and down again onto Duffield Road and like I say it's straightforward from there anyway. Yeah, nice little bit of shady. Seems quite popular, I've been seeing quite a few dog walkers. Anyway, let's carry on. Oh, there's something new. I thought I'd recognised it. This is the way we're going, it's the way before I've walked and it's quite a nice walk but you can walk all around here and it looks as though it's got some interesting names for places. Wonky Steps, Village Green, Half Moon Seat, Mum's Memorial. But anyway, we're going down this way. It's a nice little style isn't it? As Black Crag would say, that's a cute little stay late. Oh, might have to get a photo of that. an old railway line or something could well be or a quarry I think by the look of the rocks down there looks like it's an old quarry yeah going off this bridge because I don't like them right there we are we'll get down here oh sugar we'll get down here turn right and then we should be on uh, Duffield Lane or Duffield Road whatever it's called Right, so where we're going, as I said earlier on, the chimney, or stat tower, whatever you call it, is down through that way, through the path, and that will carry right on till the main road, Duffield Road, comes over this way, crosses over into um, Milford, I think it was, I can't remember now, should know, and then it should follow it along straight into Belper, and then we'll go up through the parks, and then, uh, oh, we may just finish just before Belper, actually. But anyway, yeah. Not a bad view. So Duffield is down here, hidden as you can see, but those houses just there, that's Corndon. And then Derby's right over there. Lovely part of the world. There we are, straight down the posh driveway. I think it's all private houses now as well. If you're claustrophobic, I'd stick to the road for a few, for that bit, because it's a bit tight here. And there, is the chimney. I don't know if we can get any more now. I think that's about the best we're going to get. Just there, if we can get any information on it and the mill, I will do because the mill's just over this way. Anyway, see you on the food road. Looks a bit gloomy, that cloud does, doesn't it? It's 
JP, if you watch this, it's your wet dream, this isn't it? Back of a sheep. <laughs> and even some more huge houses. Very nice around here. Right, cracking little pub, by the way. It's now going on to Duffield Road. Now, I'm not sure if that's an old hall or something. But I won't say old by the look of the building. It looks like it's all private houses now. There's some very nice houses on this street. I mean, very nice old and new. Plus, the views aren't too bad either. There's the back end of Duffield. Right over there is the back end of Milford because obviously it comes around this way. Yeah, decent views. Right, we're near Milford. Uh, so there won't be a lot to see, it's just along the main road. So I'll cut it here because um, then it'll just literally be just a few houses. Anyway, hope you've enjoyed it. Um, I'll put the website address for my, well, say photography, Mar Vikes one at the bottom. Uh, next week's walk will be up tomorrow. Um, I put all the information I can about today's walk uh, and the OS maps, I'm getting it a break for a bit because it's been playing up. So I won't be able to put the, that route on. But anyway, I hope you've enjoyed it. Any questions, don't forget to pop in the comments or, you know, don't, and forgetting, don't forget, should I say, excuse the noise, to subscribe, click that link bell. All helps for me to beat the algorithm, so to speak. It's getting really busy now. And yeah, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.